Would you like to learn more about the Hyper technology? Then this is the right video for you. Hi, I am Mareike from ABB Control Products. In this video, I would like to familiarize you with the Hyper technology that is used in our new electronic compact starter, named HF Range. Due to this special technology, the HF range has an extended lifespan of 30 million cycles and a low power loss. If you would like to learn more about the HF range itself, please find one of the video links below. Now let's have a look at the technology. A microcontroller ensures the right interaction of the components which you can see here. Switching on and off the motor is realized by their free semiconductors. Whereas no loss relays are active while the motor is running. Before starting the motor, all relays are opened. When the relays K1 and K2 are closed, the currents I1, I2 and I3 are still equal to zero. Now the microcontroller powers the semiconductors V1 and V2. Then I1, I2 and I3 can flow so that the motor runs. Semiconductors generate big losses in meaning of heat dissipation. In order to reduce this loss of power, V1 and V2 are now bypassed by relays K3 and by that turned off. Now the bypass relays carry the current while the motor is running. As a consequence, there is hardly any power loss. The same method is used by Svesa for switching off the motor. The semiconductors are activated by the microcontroller and overtake the current from the bypass relays, which are then opened. After that, the motor is switched off by de-energizing V1 and V2, so that the current equals zero now. At the end, the relays K1 and K2 are opened. The typical wear off of contact material, as seen in standard electromechanical devices, is eliminated thanks to the smart use of semiconductors. All in all, the technology enables a gentle switching and consequently a long lifespan because the relays are prevented from the switching that would usually cause arcs. You have just become an expert for the hyper technology. Thank you for listening and see you in the next video.